Hello. Hello. Uh, just had to adjust my desk one last little scotch. Had to had to lower it a tiny bit. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Just, mm. just had to get an imperfect breaching uh, mm. formation. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. My chair. Oh, did you fuck up. <laughs> uh, I did a I I did, did a you joke. Did your chair break? No, it just got it went too low, and then sometimes went too low. It won't go up after it's all the way like bottomed out right. on the little lifty. <laughs> Hello, friends. Uh, by the way, sl slice the pentagram. Very good. Very good. That <laughs> should have been, that been the strap line for every review. It should have been the yeah. subhead for this for this game. The Great. Subtitle. I'm glad you enjoyed that. Uh, all right, let's. Oh, the wizards caked up. Is that why they tactically use their hmm? Okay. Ah, uh, I don't know. It's kind of hard to tell with that big coat on. <laughs> yeah, the, the wizards. <laughs> Whether or not he's caked up. <laughs> I think he's definitely all caked up. Yeah, sure. I, I think I think so. Uh, I can see. He, he strikes me as very, uh, very concerned about such things. <laughs> all right. Uh, so yeah, so we're on our way to the, uh, that other, that other country oh, in phew. Lizard World. Yeah. Lizard World? Wizard World. Wizard World. Uh, what is our, what is the main guy's name again? The old guy? <sighs> Zan? Yeah. Is she Jan? Or Jen? That was Jan. Jan. So we got Zan and Jan. Okay. Good. I thought we did. Jan. Jan. <laughs> Jan? Jan. Zan and Jan. Jan. Okay. Right. Okay. Jan, okay. Zan and Jan. All right. Can someone explain uh, Josh this? Uh, yeah. Josh Riancar, uh <laughs> can someone please explain the slice the pentagram joke? Uh, so in tactics games, like in, in sorry, in like tactical shooters, uh, you talk about slicing the pie because of like how you sort of sidestep into a room. Uh, you slowly cover the narrow wedge of the line of sight you are slowly opening with your gun. Uh -huh. That is like slicing the pie. But with wizards, you slice the pentagram. Right. They have... Did I say lizards again? I might say it later. I, might keep <laughs> yeah, I think you said wizards. I think it's good. I don't know anymore. <laughs> Liz's still there. My gut says she needs it for something. Hmm. Kip. Is that, is that British? Optional chats. Oh. It's just one of my, uh, uh, Okay. What's your cat's name? Oh, we need we to know. know <laughs> yeah, need <laughs> I need to know about the cat. Kip is a nap. Is that one of those Britishisms? Daryl. I love these little uh, seagulls over here hanging out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's cats. <laughs> <laughs> Two very different flavors of cat, honestly. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Such disdain. Like he was—he was wasn't in a cage, really, right? He was kind of just—he's. Or is this meant to imply he isn't a carrier? Yeah, yeah. It's like a little glass see-through or, or plastic okay. see-through box. That's where all the stickers are applied to. Otherwise, they would be floating. Oh, that's true. Yeah, the stickers are in front of the cat. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, we can just keep. We can just keep chatting. Yeah. But we should let people have some for themselves. <laughs> some chats for their own place. Well. Yeah.
Oh. Is this his nap world? We're in the kip? Hi? <laughs> Training room is this, is this dream state. I see. Perfect. We're about to fight a completely meaningless battle. A filler, if you will. Okay. Oh, does this imply that we can't? Are these gonna act as windows or no? You should just... Zan, can you shoot this guy and see if... It looks like that's gonna... The netting would imply catching, right? Uh, I think burst through. I would assume burst through. Given... Because then if you don't want it to seem like burst throughable, you just put wall, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right. yeah. So how many chains do we have currently? This is still just two, right? Yeah. But the last one finishes strong. What is um this little... Is that blue barrel anything? Air canister. You can indeed shoot it. Wait, that does three? Does that say two? Three knockback. Pushes the unit. Hmm. Oh, interesting. So that one guy is gonna die. The one on the left will die. Yeah. That's fun. Hang on, should. So if he shoots this thing, well, no, I don't. Oh. <laughs> nice. Well, okay, then. Well, now we just have to zap. <laughs> I didn't even look what her little uh, thing was. That was brief. Want to do another? Oh, she needed the... Okay, so she need she, she wants to be the one to she should go through the door. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, all right. She gets the glory. <laughs> Bop. And then zap, right? Yeah. Oh, but wait, did, uh, they didn't all go out the window. Fuck. She's got to defenestrate 3 in one turn. Right, right. She can go in and then zap, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Sorry, yeah. Arg. I was like, thought I was thinking knockout and defenestrate as one concept. Okay. And it's Overwatched. Do we have the give an extra action thing? Uh, we do. That's what I was thinking. If we want to hit that specific goal, you have her do the same thing where she uses the one action to shoot the barrel and the yeah. other act. Is it, is it, wait, is the, is it all in one? Or in the same turn? Fenestrate through hostiles one turn. One turn, okay, yeah. So she can still do. If you give her two actions, she can use one to shoot and then one to zap the last guy. And that'll toss two of them. Yeah, right? Because the first, the, the explosion tosses two? 
Does, so wait, does the explosion? Because so, if we have her shoot this, she to go, go out the window. window. But then we should then stepping in should satisfy it. But it didn't. We we had her go in. Do we? Uh, did it? Did the static blast just kill the guy too easily? Oh, maybe it does two damage. Yeah, does it count as defenestration? There we go. Yeah. <clears throat> His body might have just flown out the window, but he was already dead. <laughs> right. I feel like if someone is dead when they go through the window, it should still count as a defenestration. Like, <laughs> it's, look, if it's the gravity or the bullets that kill them, I'm not really, like, they still went out the fucking window. Yeah. Sorry, sorry, not dead, knocked out. This is all yes, non-lethal right. rounds. <laughs> and they get bubbled on the way down the many stories. <laughs> Get confidence! Ooh. I do like the bright uh, feathers on this uh, jungle tracker. That's fun. Yeah. <laughs> but the way. Oh my god. How much to. Can we look at White Witch? The, the 20 one? Oh, yeah. I, mean, <laughs> I know. I know. No, like, by any means necessary. But the problem is, I feel like this is this is Jen turning a completely different person. Yeah, yeah, that's true. This this outfit is not... This is Jen when she's entered her super villainous era, I feel like. Mm -hmm. What about... Yeah, those other two. Because part of me is like, do we just save confidence for, for the big ones are they good enough to wait for what does private eye look like very good <laughs> very that's good. very good <laughs> that's pretty great yeah, maybe we save up for private eye <laughs> yeah yeah i like that okay that's fantastic that's Head that's is great. Uh -huh. dark hearts good that's all right that's this fun. feels like so you got a younger partner. <laughs> Very cool. Where what the kids are wearing these days? Honestly, Although, I think Hedge Wizard is, is one of the him. fun. It could be, yeah, for sure. Yeah. Hedge Wizard is is my favorite though, because it's like yeah, it is. It is fun. <laughs> uh, Blackout is fun though. Like I love the yeah. Sam Fisher. Ass, yes. Uh, the glowing bits are very good. Hedge Wizard is great. <laughs> Hedge Wizard is right, just so the end. Yeah, yeah, I, I would, I would say so. So under dreams, is that, is that all uh, optional side stuff then? We must revisit. I've moved on. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Stephanie. Scry is popping off. Turrets. <laughs> Have you seen any how much people, uh, like, how much Sonos has pissed people off? Uh, apparently, in particular, there, this new product that they kind of, like, went all in on. Um, one, like, it, it, it's fucked a lot of things up. Apparently yeah. they updated their app in a way that... My, it was so bad my parents noticed. They are like, why doesn't Sonos work Oh, anymore? my God. Oh, uh, no. But this, this new product that they want, went all in on, another thing that people have mentioned is uh, there's, a, there's apparently really a, an unusually shitty button. And you know that, like, customers have learned to tolerate pretty bad physical feedback with buttons. Mm -hmm. And even by those standards, people were like, does this button work? This is fucked. Wow. But it, it, that just reminded me of, like, the degree to which we've all now trained ourselves. Just, like, hold buttons down, mash them repeatedly until something happens. Yeah. Please work. Uh, so what are our optionals here for the confidence? 
prevent reinforcements, prevent two reinforcements, so, and then try to get done in three turns. Yeah. Interesting. I wonder what prevent means specifically. Yeah, are the reinforcements, that's a reinforcement door. Yeah, it looks like one at least. There's one. Okay, so wait, if Zan, so hang on, if we leave him, leave him off with him. Yeah, shoot. Mm, no. from over here will we go through the window yes there we yeah. go yeah that's what we like to say <clears throat> interesting yeah there's only this one breaching door right yeah, yeah. God, they really got that... The wine of those um, floodlights down. Oh, is it that? Is it that thing at the back? This? Yeah, it's probably that. <laughs> I sure was worried for a second that something was buzzing in my cables. <laughs> it might be through my mic. No, because I, I muted uh, the SRT oh, and it, yeah, went it went away. Yeah. It is absolutely just like, ah, this is, this is, the, this is the electric buzz room. <laughs> Can you zap the 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 chain? Each no, I wouldn't. There's no way. How many bounces do we have? We 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 check this out. We have two. Wait, two? this thing can go. You can defense What? They are knockable. <laughs> Hang on. Okay, that's that's the change my player's turn. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that's spectacular. I would definitely have assumed that wasn't going to work. Uh, but I can't just... could drop this guy yeah if you gave yourself Ugh. if you gave your Zan if you gave Zan the extra turn the extra is it an extra action or extra turn it's, only, it's an extra action because he can't move twice so he can't move kind of okay you're to do yes yes to be able to uh, disable the turret and, yeah Wait, was that guy that you knocked out the window directly in front of the window? Was it just one space? I think so. Okay. I'm not sure. But I feel he was right there, yeah. I'm trying to think if there's anything else we need to do with Xan, but I think I think we're actually good. I like the I like taking out the, the turret because it's probably harder to deal with in the long run than the, the guy. Yeah, that's very true. <clears throat> and then we just take cover. Hide. Duck! Hmm. 
still can't quite make it. I'm sure, however, if you knock that, <laughs> if you knock that guy into the electricity wall back there, it's not going to be good for him. No, no, probably won't be. <laughs> uh... No, oh, not, not the enough. Into the wall. Yeah, yeah. So maybe her little static boost, static burst. Chain bolt. Yeah. Chain bolt. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait. No, it's still not quite, huh? Well, it'll be the end of him. Yeah. Neither of them was close enough to get to the door, right? Like, Jen couldn't run that far? No. Oh, hang on, though. That would work nice. Who has an action unused? Oh, okay. And she really has to do everything herself. <laughs> Nice. Objectives complete. We're working our way towards some nice coats. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> Why do you know? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Wait, what do you say about an old hacking trick? You just let me try something. New ability. Ah. Uh, it. That's yeah. fun. So we can make the turret yeah. shoot at the little the at the Faco. Benny, who wants the extra action? Feels most useful on her, but false profit's good. This mm. seems like they're giving it to us to use a lot. Yeah.
How does so how does yeah how does that work? Yeah, false well, prophet. Like so she shoot him. Feels like we can live with that. Yeah, I'm trying to think of what the other option is, because that that's basically as far as either yeah. of them could move, right? I think, but maybe maybe we weren't aggressive enough. No, that's that's as far as he can move. He can get to here. Right. That's it. I guess he also has time. Boo. Uh, that only gives him an extra shot. Um. And you can only do predictive in orthag and all this. Like, yeah, you can't do a diagonal. So does false prophet allow anything else to happen? Like, is it just a decoy? Just okay, a decoy. just a decoy. Uh, yeah, I don't think the false prophet can do hit do this, right? That was my question. It's like, no, it can't do anything. Okay. There's upgrades that let it do stuff. Okay, that's neat. Into that. Attacking time. And what are the other, what are our side objectives? What are our code objectives? <laughs> finish a max health and finish this turn. Okay. Seems doable, right? Ding. You're pale, man. <laughs> you sure you're okay? Ugh. Is this related to that weird, like, arachnid thing that kidnapped uh, Liv at the start of the game. Oh, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> oh. I'm missing someone. Close to a tank. It 
says there's four enemies, but I only see three. Oh, the turret, the, the turret, the turret, the turret, the turret, yeah. turret. I missed the turret. Makes sense. That guy's in prime position to be pushed into that fucking electric electricity wall. <laughs> Found something Kyle loves more than defenestration. <laughs> uh, wall electrocution. Yeah. It does, does that did that does that first one push him at all the first uh, barrel? No, it doesn't. I'm trying no, to think they're here. like an angle think. here. I'm curious which way it would push him if he was in range. Secondary breach. Can you gale grenade the barrel? Well, yeah, but it's still out of range. You know what I mean? Like, none of these will touch him. That's what I mean. Isn't that is Gale Grenade not uh, just a push? So she's about to move into the room, and then it'll set them off. I think. Yeah, it'll set them off. You can I guess you could push him closer, right? Or does he not? Oh, he resists pushback. Interesting. Mm. Interesting. What if you throw the gale grenade kind of at the front corner here, in front of that f the closest uh, one? Um, like here? Yeah, so that pushes it back by one. It does. How much damage does this do? Does this do any? Does it knock him back two, right? Or three? It does, yeah. Ooh, that's pretty good. Oh no. We don't have a condition where we can't take damage though. We might just want to eat it. Yeah, that's true. So wait, the predictive predictive would um Wait, hang on. Yeah. Would predictive kill him out, right? It might. I was thinking about how we position him to do that. Yeah. Uh, maybe it would be... In that direction, yeah, maybe. Because where will that knock him? Oh! Oh, it didn't work. No, I think you need the... You have to damage it, right? Ooh! That's so, how you get Chain Bolt on him. That's how you get Bolt on him. Right. So if we go back to the opening move and switch them. Yeah. Oh, you're moving Jen, so yeah. 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 There we go. Alright, now, reach. In you go.
Nice. And we just have one, two, three, possibly four people for the next round. Yeah, that's doable. Ooh. Can either of them reach the reinforcement door? Or should we set Xan up for um Predictable. Predictable, well, yeah. We wanna take this turret over too. Oh that that'll do it, right? If you take the turret over, it'll shoot the guy who comes through the door, yeah. in theory. Will it shoot before he shoots? It will. Yeah. But it'll shoot before the guy comes through the door too. So it's like, do we want to use uh, Jen to? He is the only one who can make the controller this turn. Right. I was saying. I was thinking. Could we use Jen to zap? That guy. Like, if we sidle her up into that doorway, will she have an angle on. She will. On the man. I think just. Yeah. Zap. Okay, so then that one gets taken out. Interesting. Interesting. Now nobody can make the door. Now nobody can make the door. Yeah, okay. Uh, Bummer. Can you... Ooh, ooh. How many... Can you use a barrel? Oh. Oh, this works. Just just for C, right? And then he dies? Yeah. And if he dies, he dies. Well, she can't actually target him, though. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> so many explosions. There we go. Nice. Objectives complete. Yeah. All right. And what are what are our optionals here? So we know going in. Uh. Okay. Yeah. Predictive. All right. So. She and can... finish. I've got an Overwatch. Nice, nice. Can, um, oh. False profit. Yeah, this is what I was gonna say. We could false profit, right? Yeah. 
If we false profit next to the door, will it shoot the... Barrel? Yeah, slash the person that comes out. Yeah, I guess we can try that. Just I'm to see what how the timing's gonna work out. Yeah. <clears throat> nope. Oh, it just it pushes it though, which is interesting. Yeah. That's good to know. We're gonna have two people come in. Wait, should we put him in the corner? Can he make the corner? I thought he could. Restricted movement? Oh, sorry. That was Jen's yeah, he's box. He's pretty limited. You can move two. Oh, we can move him with the grenade, right? That doesn't do damage, it's just shoves. A little friendly shoving. <laughs> Cause then you can predictive on um Oh, but then nothing's gonna Oh she well maybe she can. So my thought here is Jen does the zap, double zap for these two guys, right? Does that get it close enough to kill? Oh, now he goes into the corner. I see. Okay. Well, that's still. Is there an angle where he bumps into that b barrel? Barrel bumps? Because that barrel is an explosive barrel. Yeah. Right? Like, if you get on the end of that little box that you're hiding behind instead of uh, to the side of it, will that cause him to go straight back into the red barrel? Sorry, what movie planet are you thinking? Uh, basically, if you take Jen, yeah, if you rewind here for one, just to see where they were originally placed. Yeah. Is there enough force on the bolt on the chain bolt to push that man into the red barrel back there? Uh, this guy. So she was in a different position. Right. If she was like. On, at the end of this, instead of around the side of it. Like, there, yeah. Oh, but it doesn't explode. Yeah. Mm, I see. And I assume the range of that explosion, if you hit the barrel, is just a single around, right? Oh, wait. So, hang on. Mm. 
Okay, I see what... Interesting thing. I don't know if it's useful for this scenario, but Scarecrow Deluxe has mentioned there's a, there's a way we can sort of cheese uh, Predictive Bolt into play here. Hmm. Um... line of sight. <laughs> and then you can still, wait, you can still keep going. Right, but you can't move anymore. No, but is there any good shot that he could take? Nah, yeah. Yeah, how big is the explosion radius on the red barrels? Just one? Yeah. Just one, okay. Boop, 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 boop. Their first turn might have been pretty decent. Yeah, uh, the only other thing I, I can see here is knock, mm. knocking either Xan or the barrel closer to in order to so one one world where we use Zan's predictive over there mm, yeah in order to stop the in, incoming right oh but will it not let us set up because of the turret static static blast only does one right No. Oh. But uh. now we can't. But it doesn't matter as much. Move. Right. Move there. Give him a little, little friendly grenade shove. This, fire through well I think the what the, is, the issue is that the enemy is all yeah it says right there enemy already there mm. because he has got a clear shot it can't be predictive wait wait do you still have access to Jen's no no the one action is that yeah well he can give her an action because then if she can she zap the the if she zaps the turret from this angle, will it move out of the way? Right, if you, yeah, time boost. Gen, chain bolt. It will move Shove, out of the way. and then you can, can you still shove, yeah, shove that guy. Bop, bop. And then a friendly gale grenade. Friendly, friendly little gale grenade. And then a little predictive bolt for the guy coming through the door. And then, yeah, because there's no other, no. she just takes cover. Yeah. Oh wait, is the, he can't do a, a profit from there at this point? Well, he can, but she's not gonna take damage. Okay, cool. And it does take mana. So. It takes mana. He doesn't have it right yeah. now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Seems good to me. Are you gonna are you gonna get both of these? Oh interesting. <laughs> interesting. Oh, he's super boxed in. <laughs> That's fun. Okay. Got three There's people the left. Grenade. Get turned off if he dies, or is that just gonna happen now? Looks like it's just gonna happen. Uh, the the grenade. Sorry. 
Yeah, the grenade that's over here. Oh. Yeah, Fun. you can't move out of this zone now. Uh, but, hang on. We can do. Maybe just shoot it. And then move. No, he's gotta move first. He can't, he can move. He can move out of the, the danger zone. Nice. Mana, we need that false prophet. She can do another double zap right here. Oh, it needs the action. The action is the thing that's oh, yeah. holding us back. Interesting. Yeah, I didn't think that that guy was i didn't realize that that guy was gonna come out first i didn't and, think he was gonna be such an asshole about it and eat and yeah just basically eat it and be like oh, i'm still alive <laughs> um oh oh yeah that's a good point zan hasn't done a shot we could have him shoot the barrel instead of uh, Jen. And then Jen can do a little zappy on the, the two that are left. Because he's still out of range of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, ooh. Yeah, wait. Ooh, ooh, wait. Hold on. Yeah, what are you thinking? If you predictive bolt straight ahead uh, towards that door, can yeah. you use... Will that blue barrel next to the... Next to the turret knock it into the predictive bolt? Yes, I was thinking that too, but it won't kill it. Not We're enough damage. A problem. Yeah, <clears throat> it'll still be exposed. How much damage does predictive do? It's like... Three or whatever? Four. But then it has um, a pip of armor. armor. Ooh, annoying. Okay. Then then maybe the call is just to zap this guy and then zap the turret, right? Yeah. So that'll, that'll bop him and then bop the turret to the left so that it loses line of sight. On Zan. She'll have to take cover. Hang on. Yeah. She can't make the. No, she can't. No. But in theory, could she do it from over here so that she's not in line of sight of the. No, it won't work. Oh, yeah, try the turret first. Then, yeah, there you go. Ah, she's still in line of sight of the, the thing. Enough Hide. <laughs> Hide. Accept outcome. Yeah, now Xan on the door. Jen on the thing. Bingo, bango. All done. Beautiful. Oh, we didn't do that. No! <laughs> oh, yeah, fuck. <laughs> it's fuck. Okay. We fucked up. I forgot. We undid that. We did it. We did do it the first time, then we undid some things. Yeah. How do I unlock you? I think we just have to end the turn, right? Let me in. I just want to say hi. <laughs> I just want to say hello. Yeah, done. Yeah. No.
Less confidence. We're never gonna get a good code at this rate. Oh no. Please. Oh my god. <laughs> well, never gonna get a good rate <laughs> code at this rate. I wonder why you're not anymore, huh? <laughs> Pretty big violation of the Hippocratic Oath, if you ask me. <laughs> yeah, some real fucked up stuff has shown up in the continuing <laughs> education material. <laughs> Damn. Strybeck system syndrome. Ooh. That is hard for her, but on the other hand, she has the sort of face that really goes with those tiny little goggle eyes. Little <laughs> lenses. Yeah. And I, like, strongly envy that. It's a good look. It's a good look. Like, Kato, you, have a, you, you, you like me, have a broader face. Mm -hmm. So, like, do you also <laughs> suffer from the, like, I think aviators look cool, but I struggle to make them look cool on me. <laughs> yeah, I think too big. You can't go too big. Also, two yeah. bound. Not good. Yeah, it's but but I yearn. I just want you know what? Maybe I'm I am letting. If I want my cool steampunk goggles, they just don't have to be those steampunk goggles. Yeah, you have options. They can be they can be big old <laughs> pilot bug eye goggles. For a while. Damn, okay. Oof. Huh. Sternotomy? Huh. Fuck. Were the clamps in there? <laughs> oh, no. Rewind people. Oh. Oh. Aha. <laughs> I see. So we have a problem here where <laughs> friendship ended with Je with uh, with Jen. Banks is my new best friend. Yeah. <laughs> the whole the whole aesthetic, the look, yeah. it's just all. It's great. <laughs> I have to shoot them first. You understand. <laughs> That's amazing. Uh... This uh, music, too, for this scene is beautiful. There's a skull on her belt. <laughs> That's a fair point. That is a fair point. She appears to have the largest caliber pistol I've ever seen. It's quite, yeah. <laughs> Real, like, real big on the hip there. Bungee hand cannon artists would have been like, I don't <laughs> yeah. know. Yeah. Too much?
It's kebab time. Yeah, love a good kebab. <laughs> but yes, complete. <laughs> Ding. Ooh. Ooh. Hell yeah. Let's see what we can get. I feel like that last mission taught me I need more mana in... You know yeah. what I mean? Like... Yeah. But what are the upgrades for False Prophet? Send a uh, Prophet Fire Sears main oh. attack at a nearby enemy. Uh. Fuck. <laughs> hey, that's an extra attack. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. Oh my god. That. Yeah. Oh my fucking god. Get to the door, seal it. Oh my god. Uh, but, uh, uh, there's like, ah, jeez. Okay, every one of these is good. <laughs> oh no. Oh my god. <sighs> okay, so I think we can agree. This seems neat. Yeah. But these all seem really good. Yeah. Yeah. I think, huh? I feel like I want that. Well, I want the interaction. I know. First, I know. and then there's maybe so many the. Times I want to be able to close a door. Right. Or use a terminal. Yeah. Hundred like, percent. And you just can't you reach can, it. Kids, that mean you can get mana for him? Because then, fuck validation. <laughs> right. Yeah. Maybe. Oh. What? Oh my god, we can get a... A second oh. move? But... Once per encounter, you get a second move. Oh my move. god. Oh my god, she can also <laughs> do this. So her kit is towards mobility. Yeah, yeah. Okay, but here's, here is the one problem I have, Kato. Uh-huh. Just getting another target with a chain bolt seems it's so gonna be It's gonna be very strong. But there's so often, there's so many times when there's not three targets, too. Right. But there's often three things she could hit. Right. <laughs> yes. Uh, it's tough. I think may maybe plus one target and then second win ne next. We just queue that one up. It's like, this is what we're going to pick next time. I don't know. Yeah. <sighs> Refresh your move after firing, though. That's no. being able to shoot. I'm, I'm kind of like these all sound fucking awesome. Yeah, I can't. I, I'm, I'm trying okay. to decide and I can't. I think. Oh, just being also, like, I kind of want to start dumping shit into the Gale grenade because if yeah. you use it twice and then plus one use per encounter and it gives people the extra move, then uh, it gives a shit. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't even need a, a third target. Let's, right, let's see. Start with one use. One use. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, no, that's, that's gonna, you, I, I was gonna. I was gonna. I was gonna say what. Let's see how useful the extra move is, or how often we can figure out a way that to make it useful. Because you can always refund the perks. Yeah. After that's like, true. That's true. This is not permanent. So we can. I. I would want to see how that. How it 
feels, you know? And yeah. then maybe we come back and if we haven't leveled up yet, we can swap it over if we think having two of them would be more useful. Arrowick, I tend to agree. Like this, but the same way as like, we probably should have point, put points into Zan's gun. Yeah. But we just can't. The problem is, I would rather scaffold together a mousetrap turn. Yeah. Hundred percent. Rather than shoot someone in this game. That's what this is. This is what this game is. It's about shuffling your pieces into a perfectly shaped uh, arcane symbol where they all die. <laughs> Dreams. Dreams. I don't know why I drew that out so much. Dreams. Tower of turrets. Oh, is that the one we just did? I think the first one was the one we did, right? So is this going to be the level we've seen, or is it a special, no, special challenge room? Yeah, yeah. It's challenge rooms. That you can get confidence in. What are our confidence options? Reactions in one turn. Finish by the end of turn two. Okay. So that would require him picking up some intel and throwing two and time boosts. Interesting. <laughs> Yikes! <laughs> Who <Whew>. just immediately got? <laughs> well, zapping that guy. That will kill him, right? Because he'll go into the wall. Yeah. And then... Okay, we have... I think I know. Okay. Uh... Ba -ba 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 -ba. Zap zap. I wish we had three. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Shit. That's fair. That's fair. Well, this is very. This is a very dense room. To be fair, I feel like this is one of the denser rooms. Usually, we don't have seven enemies on the board so far. Mm, but she needs to stay in, inside of him. kill him I would have thought it would have broken his overwatch too yeah how vexing quite
wants to go out the window. Ooh, can you, Although if you this hit. This would, yeah. Well, Sorry, what were you thinking? If you mouse over on the, uh, the, the man that's close to being defenestrated up there in the top of the yeah. screen. Yeah. If that lands there, which way would that push him? I don't know. You can try it. Yeah. Uh, doesn't doesn't it move him, here. which is Oops, very. Oh. There we go. If we do this. Boom. Gone. Can you zap zap? Uh, that man out the out the window. If you um. Uh, zap that man. Right. What? Uh, chain bolt the man against the the electricity. Yeah. And then the chain bang. bolt that man. Yeah. That takes two off the board there. And now no one's targeting us at least. We false profit here to clear the one that is, yeah. Wait, actually, uh, yeah, that one is what I was thinking. That was her move. Yeah. That. Grab the intel. Um. Mm. You can just kill that guy, right? The one out front. His gun sucked. <laughs> it does feel like getting two off the board with the zap might be the best we do this turn on Jen's gen stuff. Shot kill, okay. Yikes. Do they all hit him before they do? However, we oh, No not not that way, not that way. Uh da, da, da. If he grabs the intel yeah. and throws a time boost, time boost, question is where do we go here? That might be the hmm. You could at least eat that guy out the window. Yeah, there and could be a good. There could be a yeet. Oh wait, what about around the corner then? Uh, Here? right there. Yeah, right there. Still yeet, but then it's out of line but, of sight of the but, other ones. But I would. But this way, she gets the the intel. then 
Oh my god. What? There's just so much on the board now. So they only go into Overwatch, that's funny. Is there any way we could chain bolt them? Oh wait, can you move the grenade? Can you chain bolt the grenade? No. If we had a different angle on them, we could maybe knock them into their own grenade, which would be funny. He's zapped first. Um, he doesn't. He can't. Doesn't have the mana to give her the thing. No, but can he move to that corner and shoot that guy into the into the grenade zone? I think we're not gonna get a confidence on this one. Oh no, it's like at an angle. Yeah. Is there a better way to use her zap, maybe, then? Like, can we get a better angle on some of these? I'm trying to think. If we... Oh, let's rip the Overwatch. Overwatch? Oh, yeah, because... Yeah, oh, she crossed... That's not where I want you to... Go, oh, Sam. That's I want you to go here, not. That's funny. I don't like that pathing. Yeah, that's weird. Wait, couldn't she kill two here? She is gonna kill two. Oh, okay, yeah. No, that didn't move into the line of fire. Fuck. But Interesting. What about the other way? What? He, go, he shoots first. He shoots first. He shoots first. That's so fucked up. That is the most bullshit I've ever seen. That's quite frankly hilarious. Um, is there a is there a, is there a um, what's the word I'm looking for? Uh, waypointing. Movement thing here at all? No, right? No. Yeah. So it has to be the secondary guy. They won't shoot each other, right? If they cross each other's line of sight? Are our, our two heroes? No. No, I mean, um, the, the enemies. If you, like, punt one of them into... They'll shoot anyone who enters their line of sight. Okay, that's good to know. So if you, z if you zap from here, if you zap from this, this angle, zap the one straight ahead, and then zap the other one, uh, the one... Uh, I meant the other, uh, sorry. The one close to the grenade area. That's not gonna knock him into it, right? It's a little too angled. Mm 
No, but it just... Well, it kills him. Yeah. I just need one more tiny morsel of mana. Yeah, I think the one extra mana that existed was closing the door, right? Hmm. Which I don't, I don't know if that's available still. Oh, there you go. It is. It that's is. fun. No, it'll kill him, but it won't. Yeah, we won't finish Hang this on. turn. He just shoots this guy. No, just gets blocked. Yeah, it needs to be two knockback. That's so funny that they shoot each other. Um. <laughs> Can he shoot from here? And hit the no on the other guy, yeah, that guy. Bummer. He's literally doing no damage. No. no. I don't have any way to shove him over, huh? No. Okay. Yeah, I think at this point the only thing we can do left is... Bummer. Alright. Yeah. Bop. Ding! Alright. Uh, so, my feeling at the end of that... ...is we pick badly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this thing sucks. Like without these, without something else happening, this is not. This is not useful enough. Yeah, it depends on the, on the layout a lot. The chain I... bolt will always be useful, probably. But... Yeah, I'm that or like the two. And I'm, am I even wild about useful fiction versus getting the mana back in play? But this this is also gonna be hard to make fire. Right, useful fiction's you... nice. But yeah, I think she needs either one more target, or an extra gale grenade, or maybe the jolt. Hmm. 
Yeah. I like... I like... I do like target. Um... One use per encounter... An extra use per encounter does seem nice though. Yeah. Good flexibility. The jolts is moved twice every turn, yeah. If we're using our action point on static blast, which we're not, honestly. That's Cha the problem. Chain bolt is yeah. more useful usually. Yeah. Time bomb? Am I thrilled with conviction? I feel like this isn't... We're not getting enough out of this. No, I don't think so. What does time bomb do? Uh, okay, not useful yet. I assume we get more... More. I think this is persistent, right? We're thinking to protect the mana cost. Well, because think about it in that room that we were just doing it. Yeah, that was it nasty. Would it would immediately come back. You would get the mana yeah. back. Yeah, well, you could have just cleared. You're right. And we could have cleared. You could, clear, you could clear all of the Overwatch on yeah. the board, basically. That was very specific to that room, but... But it's it was a demonstration of how powerful this will be. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. And then... Maybe we're going all in on this. Because then, like, we do this and then give her point blank. And then she's less, like, right now, she's just, like, hoovering up all the mana. You know what I mean? Like, because yeah. we're so dependent on Chain Bolt, she is consuming all the mana on the board. Yeah. It's just... Because it's, it, it's powerful, right? Like, you get multiple targets out of it. I'm having trouble choosing between those two, but let's try Static yeah. Blast and see how it feels. Yeah. And I think in that case, stat, like, Refreshing Jolt is the play. Like, I would like the damage to be augmenting Refreshing Jolt, but, like, the movement is kind of what we're here for, right? Yeah. But, which means we can be riskier with her positioning, her, like, starting positioning if we plan around getting it back. like to survive as long as we can oh yeah well until turn 10 it looks like well this is pretty easy right just bloop. out the window grab the intel I think you were right there if we want to set up a... Oh, you can't. If you want to move right in front of that guy, you can shoot him out the window and then set up a protective, right? Yeah. Which... Arrival two turns, arrival one turn. Okay, so this this door is going to have something going through it. These doors are going to have something going through immediately, though. Mm, so I'm thinking... Next, the turn after this, right? Because the, the, the next turn is going to have... 
the, the where the guy says four. Like no one's coming through that until a turn after. Right, so that. You're correct. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Maybe we just choose a door to predictive bolt for this yeah. turn, right? Yeah. Which one, though? Grenade launchers have one of the best noises for a weapon, right? <laughs> yeah. It is just one of those satisfying... The thump. Thump. It's pretty good. Oh, God, what is it? There's a thing. Okay, fucking hates it. Every time I interact with it, I end up making a little mortar noise. Yeah? Can't remember what it is. <laughs> I think it's with the dogs. Point is, we all yearn to fire a grenade launcher or drop a fun little mortar round into a tube and watch yeah. it fly off. <laughs> yeah. I always think th I, three is stuck in my head, and I can't train myself out of it. That it's only <laughs> one damage. Right. Uh. Okay. Yes. Good zapping. She has, she has so much mana. <laughs> she does. She does. Very nice. Do we want to set Zan up in front of the door to the right on the right side? Hmm. Um. But because... our boy is hungry for mana. I was gonna right. put him here, pop him in the predictive. And well, I was gonna say, dude. there's the one to the north, right? Oh wait, that's is that one off? No, yeah, yeah. Damn. If we put him in front, if we put Zan in front of the door that's uh, at the top near the top of the screen, uh, where that intel is. Uh, that one. 
he can predict of the person coming in through that door down there, right? Yeah, because this wall is too high. What? No, the um, the other one, that one, this door. Oh, this one. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then let those other two people come in, and Xan has a lot of. We can do some um, bolt shenanigans on the next turn. Oh, because she's got. Bolt <laughs> she's got like four mana to use. We should use it up. Yeah. I think, can Jen just kill these two with, with zaps from here? She can. But is it the sexiest way to kill people? <laughs> <laughs> I know. We need to save our mana. But one yearns. Oh, I was thinking she should zap the double zap them yeah then, no, I was thinking, but yeah but he, i'm not sure we even need to do that because you both get the kill but he needs to be in a position to drop another uh right this bolt. this was the this was the thing yeah. i was trying to figure out um because if you tuck him into that corner i guess he could, could you can shoot first right like if he shoots here does he kill that guy he can but he only kill this dude basically from the one angle right well no i oh. guess he could Nope, can't do that. Right. If he shoots from here, could he do... Then there's nothing he can cover with predictive. Well, he could still move, right? After shooting? No, I think that's only her. Wait, what? Wait, hold on. Yeah. Let's let's try that real quick. Because I could have sworn it doesn't matter what order you do it in. Just give him the... Yeah, have, him sh have Zan shoot from here. And then we'll see if you still have the option to move. Yeah. Well, let's change the order of targeting. But yes, he does have the option to shoot. Okay. To move. And she can just now kill this guy. Yeah. Wow. And then you can tuck Xan and Back predictive. Yeah, predictive yeah. across that, that doorway. Oh. Ah. Oh. It's like they want to die. <laughs> oh, that is the purpose of these rooms. <laughs> we should get points for finishing it with all the mana. All of the <laughs> just, 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 yeah. All the, all the mana. Like. Our house is gonna look like that p police evidence lockup. Yeah. Oh my god. I'm just curious. Yeah, it felt good. <laughs> Wake him up. All right. Uh, now. But can she go out and she sent him out the window instead? Ooh, maybe. Yeah. No, oh! it's, not, it's not window coded. It's not windowed. Door coded. That's that's uh, that's wrong. Yeah, it's uh tragedy. 
Either way, it's only going to do one damage, right? Yeah. But what if you shoot him back? What do you mean? Yeah, and then she can zap him into that wall. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we want to be boring about it. We can do that. We, can do <laughs> we don't have to, you know. Really, Kata, we don't have to do anything. Dude, yeah, I have to get fancy with it. A single mediocre turn just unlocks <laughs> bottomless nihilism. <laughs> oh. It was a fine turn. It was a fine turn. A fine turn, I say. <laughs> On my word. <laughs> One yearns for shenanigans. I think there's shenanigans. Oh, I know. Yeah, I know. I know what it is. Okay. Yeah. yeah You've I got some shenanigans. I got some shenanigans. Pretty good shenanigans. Uh, but it has expired. We took that bonus off, so now we can't turn around and, and predictable that. Which is oh, hard. right. <laughs> the, yeah. the double predictive doesn't work anymore. Yeah. Can you... Hmm. And then chain bolt? Yeah. Very nice. Yes. Very, very that is nice. Good. Just in front should be good, right? Well, maybe she waits over here. Pushes this guy out a window. True. And then comes over and cleans up this dude. Yeah. Better make sure she has the mana. <laughs> Gotta have the mana. What would you do without the mana? Zap. Thump. I didn't like the way that that guy thunked against the, <laughs> the building on the way out. Oh. Will his own grenade kill him? That's why I'm, I'm thinking Gale grenade him into, or you just move, move him here. Is this their knockback or is he too resistant? He's too resistant. Yeah, he's too, too resistant. But what's the knockback on you? It only has a little bit of that tail. Yeah, I'll do that. What if you put Zan down south of that little operating table looking thing? And then predictive the door, but at be first. Ah! Excuse me. Do we time boost here? Give her a turn. Yeah. We have the mana. Yeah, we can do that. And then she has the mana to then zap that man. Yeah. You love yeah, to I see it. You love to see it. Oh, 
both up. Nicely done. You just have to complete the level for these confidence ones. That's that's easy. I'm just gonna farm this shit till we get a coat. <laughs> All right, and I think with that, we have we have demonstrated many breaches, many tactics. <laughs> uh, what's our confidence outfits? Still don't have everything we need. Close, These we're very kids close. Got to believe in themselves harder. We're getting there though. I feel like one more, so close. one more map, and we'll get there. I know, but it's gonna happen. We should probably leave it here. Sure. All right, because I gotta I gotta write some stuff uh, before the end of the day. I owe I owe a draft. So let's, <laughs> uh, let's call it there. We will we will leave our intrepid heroes somewhere in the extraction phase. I want to know all about banks, uh, but we will we'll revisit that another time. I think uh, just last thoughts here. The different ways you can kit these folks out is real good. Yeah. Like, profoundly different play dynamics based on the upgrades we've given them. Right, totally. Uh, which was a lot of fun. Yeah, it seems neat. Um, I don't even know that there's... Sometimes it, it, it does feel... There's a certain rules where you're like, there's a... There's, a, there's like, a, a correct answer here. But some rules are a little more... Freewheeling. <laughs> a little bit, but you, have you noticed how often chat someone's like, yeah, I did that, and then they have this completely different solution? Like, right. I, I right. think it feels a little bit confining insofar as, like, we see with our moveset, like, oh, here's the solution. But right. one, I'm not even sure it's as narrow as we think it is. It's just that we, like, pick a direction, we refine it until we figure a way through. Right. But, like, chat's reactions to a lot of these, like, tactical dilemmas has been, uh, not to get all Doug DeMuro out, out of nowhere, these tactical dilemmas. <laughs> uh, but chat's reactions have often been like, oh yeah, no, that's really, the, the, here's how here's how it went in my game. And they outline a completely different like line of play. Yeah, yeah, it's neat, it's neat. Um, I'm enjoying it very much. Same, same, and like <laughs> uh, for me, I think, I am someone who did feel that like, into the breach felt a little bit like too much trying to solve each turn and feeling like oh i didn't optimize enough i fucked up need to need to mm -hmm. revisit mm -hmm. this feels a little looser to me in a way that's fun more fun for me uh so like it's a little more little more in my wheelhouse i think yeah yeah either this, way this is neat yeah have, having a blast uh so yeah we'll 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 leave it there for today and uh and move on but that that was a little more tactical breach wizards and uh maybe we'll revisit next week sounds good the rest of this week what is it we've got oh we've got a g-force uh wheel of g-force stream the wheel the wheel returns yeah. where will it take us this time <laughs> and then i think on friday there's a little more a little more vulgar happening so yeah stick around for that more vulgar difficult uh, and there'll be a remap radio on friday uh but that is it for this tactical breaching uh, back with the wheel of G-Force now on Thursday. Hi.